All right, so this is a uh, club car. It's an older uh, model. This thing's probably close to 20 years old. I'm just gonna give you a quick video on how to take the wheel off. Um, this is just a plastic hubcap. I would just take a screwdriver like this, just kind of work your way around it. It's gonna just kind of pop out like that. Wow, wow, that was kind of loud. Um, these all come standard with four um, axle bolts. Um, this is the best way I think you can do this. So people offer their opinions, I realize. Um, but this is a 20 volt, excuse me, DeWalt impact wrench. This is a three quarters socket. And I bought this little nifty thing. This is the adapter for $5 at Lowe's. Um, so what I do typically, typically is I get the jack more or less set up. It's not, it's tight, but it's not lifting any pressure off the tire. Make sure your um, emergency brake is on, chalk the wheels, etc. Safety first here. Um, and so what I do is I'll just sit this on there and hit it in reverse and I'll just kind of hit it, get it loose. And I'll loose all the way. And as you can see, they're not really backed out very far. Um, you can kind of turn these just a little bit and then that way when you jack up the wheel so it's off the ground, you can just slide it right off. All right, so once you have the wheel jacked up, I, I don't do it much more than two inches at most. It's just not necessary. Um, you just loosen up the bolts, take all four of them off. All right, once all four are off, just simply slide it out like that. And you are ready to install your new wheel.